yeah, not the greatest skater. Definitely, uh, definitely not a good skater. But you know, there's only one way to get good at something, right? So, hey, I'm just gonna keep practicing those ollies because I haven't skated in a while. And uh, eventually, I'll uh, venture into the the big boy part of the park. But uh, for now, I'm just gonna hang out in this little flat area and just practice some shit. Left me breakfast outside. <laughs> I honestly think, fuck, I am puffed out. That uphill ride on the way back kills me. <sighs> I honestly think when you're learning to skate <laughs> from like very beginner, it's important to understand like skate skate park culture and that. <laughs> if you're a beginner, don't hang around in the middle. Shoot off to the side like I was this morning. Get semi-decent at what you can do and then work your way into the big stuff otherwise you just become a nuisance to the, the riders you can do all this and <laughs> you know try avoid going and peak Peak times at the skate park. That's why, like, you know, I went early this morning. Today is also a public holiday, so I couldn't imagine there'd be too many skaters there. So if you want to try to push yourself into other areas, you can when you're not blocking anyone else. But yeah, I definitely need to pick up my game. Well, that's the first time I skated in almost like a year and a half, so I'm not too upset. I'm How you going? Good, how are you? Not too bad. I'm good. Oh, look, honestly. I'm no fucking Tony Hawk, I can tell you that much for free. But, you know, every person has to start somewhere. And I guess that's the other thing you need to remember is that every, every time you're in a park, or any park, skate park, snowboard park, bike park, and you see someone who's really, really good, as much as you, you don't want to be intimidated by them and think that they're watching you, but they, event, they were at... They eventually watch you? Well, no, not that they eventually watch you, but oh. at some point, they were once a beginner as well, so. And so I don't think everyone's watching you. And plus, like, not to be a rude cunt, but you're not really that important for other people. Like, I, when I go to a skate park, that person who's doing his thing really couldn't give two fucks about what I'm doing, so just don't worry about it. Well, maybe you should say that. What might be helpful. Yo, what is up? Uh, I am just uh, finishing off today's video. Uh, you know, pretty pretty boring, not gonna lie. Uh, just, you know, this morning went to the skate park and uh, tried to do some shit. Still can't do anything, but uh, you know, you gotta start from somewhere. Um, just wanted to have a quick little chat about uh, the videos at the moment. I, I really seem to be lacking inspiration and creativity when it comes to this whole 30 day challenge. Uh, I originally, I thought I was quite a creative person. I thought that I would smoke through 30 days of creating videos quite easily. Uh, it doesn't seem to be the case. I am uh, struggling to find creative ways to show what is going on in my life at the moment without obviously having to um, exploit large amounts of money. Uh, myself and Stephanie are currently not working. Uh, I actually do have three days of work coming up tomorrow. I'll touch on that in a second. But um, myself and Steph, uh, we are sort of counting down the days until we go on this road trip on the 1st of June when my uh, old man comes out here with my, uh, my stepmom. And so, 
it's hard to go out and like, I don't want to say that money, you need money to go out and do creative things. That's definitely not what I'm saying. Especially out here, there's so many trails and so many different things that we could be doing. Uh, but at the same time, we're sort of just enjoying not having anything to do. Like the last two years uh, have been pretty full on. And you know, I obviously have just done a snow season and it looks like you have the best time of your life, which I did. But behind the scenes, you are working you know, a fair bit and then on your days off, you snowboard and so you sort of don't really get that time to just lay in the sun, which we've enjoyed so much, especially since the pool's been open, it's just been oh, fantastic. But you don't get that time to just sort of unwind and just enjoy each other's company and enjoy not having to worry about work. Um, but yeah, so I don't like this because it literally makes me feel like I am just bringing up all these excuses, which is the worst thing in the world because the quote that sticks in my head is that excuses sound best to those who say them. And it's so fucking true because I'm literally sitting here talking to the camera about why I'm not being creative and I literally hate every single word that comes out of my mouth. That's literally how I feel right now. And I can't really change much about how I feel. <sighs> yeah. I'm definitely not enjoying this process. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Uh, to the people that do watch this, you guys are great people. Um, and you know what? I know they're, you know, Moose and Johnny K. Johnny K is a big YouTuber. He fucking loves it. Doesn't do anything else. Doesn't really work, Johnny K. <laughs> Always find a way to riff on Johnny K. Love him, but... Um, but yeah, I, I have picked up work uh, for the next three days just as a laborer. Uh, Purely because they're offering really, really good money. Uh, <laughs> and like I said, we don't, uh, well, we haven't worked in the last, what's today's date? It's the 20th. So we haven't really worked for like, yeah, in 20 days. So we haven't really had an income. Uh, we got paid last Friday, I think. But like, you know, groceries and just living expenses here in Whistler are quite pricier than most other places. So, uh, <laughs> we and, and plus the fact that yeah we do have like a road trip coming up that we probably need to have some well no no, no problem we definitely need some money for so it's like you know yeah that's just that whole thing it's just like yeah but then I keep telling myself I'm like you don't need money to be creative but then I'm like just yeah big 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 battles at the moment but anyway here's another video <laughs> But yeah, so I'm going to work the next three days. I'm going to try um, still post a video every single day. Uh, I'm going to go shoot a video this afternoon that I'll post tomorrow. I'm going to shoot another uh, podcast tomorrow afternoon with a, a young lad called Cooper. Good bloke. Uh, I've really enjoyed the podcast. I feel like out of, out, of the, out of the process so far, making the podcast has been the most enjoyable thing. I uh, really, really enjoy that. And I do feel like I'm going to keep that uh, going throughout the season, even after the 30 days is finished, because I just really enjoy it. And uh, I'm definitely getting open-minded to, uh, you know, maybe having like a posting schedule of like one or two days a week once it's all done. Posting like a podcast and then posting something, because when I do start work, which is not for a while, the 14th of June, <laughs> but we do go on that two-week road trip, so it'll be right. Um, I'll have like a schedule where I post stuff. Um, but anyway, that's enough of me rambling and, you know, letting you guys know what's on my mind and how this creative process is, oh, I just feel like I'm, uh, feel like I'm in a 400 meter hurdle race and it's just, I stumble at every single hurdle. Like I'll make something I really enjoy and then I'll wake up the next day or like think about something the night before and just be like, just sat there just with no fucking idea. But anyway, um. Yeah, I wouldn't mind actually, like if you guys have any ideas, uh, from what I've learned as someone who's at like, you know, worked in a creative environment before and, you know, growing up as a kid going to art school, a big thing that what my art teacher used to do was to like, and like what Steph also used, used to do when she um, was doing her visual merchandising degree or whatever it was, was to actually compare and go around and see what your other classmates or like, you know, the people that you're working with are doing to get ideas. And you guys are the people that actually watch this channel. Um, if you guys have any ideas or something, that what, what you'd prefer to see, 
fucking let me know because I, if anything, I enjoy the create the creative process. So regardless of what it is, I'll probably be more than happy to do it and enjoy doing it. Where at the moment I wake up and I think to myself, man, what the fuck have you got yourself into? But anyway, enough rambling. Peace out. Have a good one, guys. And uh, make sure you brush your teeth at night. Why did I say that? <laughs>